Ma, I don't want to go to school today. Boy, if you don't go to school, I'm going to get that bill. Okay. See, it's about two something in the morning, you know. See, it's two something in the morning because when the numbers on the time turn, the numbers don't turn back. So, technically, it could be like 2 p.m. in another state or in another country. But right now, it's 2 a.m. where I'm currently at. See, I would tell you I'm currently at, but then again, you might try to come find me. But... Being that I don't tell you the particular area that I'm at, you may not come find me. So I'm in South Carolina. So then again, you'd be like, what part of South Carolina? But then I'd be like, man, I can't tell you. Because if I tell you, then you might try to come find me and want to get an autograph or something because I'm going to be famous. So when you watch this video, don't say I didn't warn you. And you know, we're sitting out here in the dark because, well, we just in the dark. But anyway, you know, what we're doing, we're waiting for the light to come. See, when the light come, it's going to shine over the darkness. And then when it shines over the darkness, then what happens is the light makes the dark turn light. So then the dark goes away, and then it goes to, like, the other side of the earth. But then again, the darkness comes back. And then when the darkness comes back, you're like, man, it got dark again. But then the light went away, and then it's going to come back. It's, it's just knowledge, you know. So, you know, I was just sitting here, I was doing a walk earlier, you know, as always, I like to walk to exercise, because if you exercise to walk, then you're going to walk to exercise. See, it makes sense when you don't think about it, but then again, you have to think about it in order to process in your mind. But if you don't have a mind, how can you process the thoughts that's coming to your brain? Then again, you might be like the scarecrow. Wait, what was that? Yeah, scarecrow on the Wizard of Oz. He didn't have a brain, right? He showed, anyway, it doesn't even matter, but you get what I'm saying. So, and the moral of the story is, you know, you got to stay focused within being focused when you're walking because you want to exercise and keep your body movement in the right direction because if you go in the wrong direction, then you may make, you may make a left turn, but if you make a left turn, how can you make a right turn? If you make a right turn, you may not burn the right, right amount of calories, you know, so it's just knowledge for you to think about, but then again, if you don't think about it, how can you think about it and gain the right knowledge that I'm speaking to you? It's just knowledge. See, I like to call this my quiet room. You know, let me kick some knowledge to you real quick. The reason it's a quiet room, because there's no loudness in here. See, there's no loudness for the possibility to even get in here because the walls are enclosed. But see, if the walls were open, noise would be able to come in. See this? That's solid brick. But if this brick had holes in it, sound could come through. So that's why I call it my quiet room. See, I come in here in order to be quiet. But technically, I'm not quiet right now because I'm talking. So I guess this would be my loud room inside my quiet room. And I know it doesn't make sense yet, but all you have to do is sit there and let it progress in your mind. But if you don't have a mind, how can you determine what can you progress? So anyway, you know, just sitting here kicking some knowledge. And you know, I... I was doing some thinking, like, why why even do these videos? Why even kick so much of this ill knowledge to you people? But then I thought about it, and I said, you know, some of you may not be educated, so it's my job to give you education. Because if you're not educated, and I'm educated, but if I don't give you, if I don't give you any education, excuse me, then how can you be educated? And then I get even more educated when I give you the education of what I've been educated on. So, you know, it's just, it's just knowledge, you know? Some of you probably can't afford to go to college. You know, you probably don't have any money. So what you can do is like, man, I need some knowledge. Let me go to Kevin McLeod's YouTube page, get some of that ill knowledge. Boom, become smart. Then you can create your own college so people that can't afford college, they can come to your college. But you need to be able to pay for your college so you may have to charge them a fee. So then again, they probably can't even afford to come to your college. So now you suffering from the college that you opened and you couldn't even afford to go to college in the begin with. So I know it's I know it's tough, you know, but stay with me. Um you know, it's so much to be thankful for in this beautiful world. You know, you gotta be thankful because when times get hard, how can it be easy? But then again when things get easy, it's just the complexity of the mind. So you like how hard I came with that complexity. Well actually I looked that up in the dictionary because I wanted to know a big word. But you know stay focused. Don't don't even pay any attention to that. But anyway um, but see the complexity of the duality of the circumference of the mind to the second degree is the fifth power of the evolution of time that blew up when the world transgressed to what it transferred from and it transferred from the, yeah, I'm just kicking knowledge, you know, I, I don't want to get too much into it. I don't want to, you know, confuse you. 
you know, it's just education. It took me a while to learn too, you know, so don't feel bad, you can get it. But anyway, you know, it's just ill knowledge that I'm kicking to you. You see this right here, this is why I like to call it a jacuzzi. You know, other you other people might consider it as water, but you know, you look at it and you think, why is it called a jacuzzi? Well, reason being, when you're at the beach, the water flows in a certain way, but in a jacuzzi, it gets bubbly. Well, technically it's not bubbly right now. It kind of looks like the beach, but we're not at the beach because we're in the jacuzzi. But the reason we're in the jacuzzi, because we're trying to lay back and relax. But I'm not going to get in there because I have to go to work. But I just thought that the water looked kind of clear and looked nice. But it's probably some dirty people that's been in there. But thank God for chlorine. The reason to have chlorine cleans your body, cleans your mind. But if you're in there for too long, it burns your eyes. That ain't fun. You know, it's just now it's not kicking to you. But anyway, so you're probably thinking, well, man, how come water is so clear? The reason that it's clear is because the crystals that's inside the water, they formulate, turn in a certain direction, and then they come back around, they shine off the light and give you a clear view. So you, if you saw some black water, you're not going to want to jump in the water because you might think that it's oil. And then if you jump in, it really might be oil and you're like, oh no, I jumped in some oil, what am I going to do? Then you have to jump out, then find some water to jump into. But if you find some more water that's dark, you might end up jumping in some more oils. You know, it's just knowledge. You see, now the camera's back on me. Reason being, I didn't want to end the video with you just looking at water. You'd be like, man, that's kind of boring for me just to look at water. And it's kind of messed up for Kevin to end a video without even saying goodbye. You know, what kind of person would I be in? What kind of person would I be without saying goodbye? Because if I didn't say goodbye, then how can I say hello the next time? So if I say goodbye now, I can say hello the next time. Then you can say, oh, snap, he said hello. Let me write in the comments. Let me say hello back. Man, he might subscribe. Let me subscribe to him so he can subscribe back. But if I don't say bye, you're like, man, that's rude. He's an a-hole. I ain't going to say goodbye to him. But at the end of the way, at the end of the way, hold on. That ain't even sound right. At the end of the way. At the end of the day, um... Bye. I see the story turning cold, hope everybody getting bold Looking at my nose as I smell the fear Then I go out, I see the deers I go to follow, but then everybody shooting at me I'm hollow, but then I'm like ABS the I turn the light Bright night, I see the nights turn to days As I'm in a maze, as I'm puffing on haze But I had to quit, I'm looking at the counterfeits Fitting me like a cap, I'm looking at the map Trying to be exact, I gotta find my different way Hopefully I don't get shoot down like AKs and Mac Coming to me for some I don't even wait Jordans I'm in loafers, everybody want me to be a chauffeur But I can't lead you to the right way Different path, I go 